All right, so what's up, everybody? Welcome to the channel. We are so happy to be back here each and every single day. Y'all know y'all give us life, but it is your boy, Jay. Hey, y'all. It's your girl, Amber, and today we are revisiting an artist that, when the name came through for a second suggestion, honestly, I didn't remember too much about the first one. We've only done it one time. Yeah, so I'm excited to see what we're going to get into with this second try at him. So we're listening to Harry Nilsson, and the song is Without You. It was like, I want to say eight or nine months ago we reacted yeah. to him. So like I said, we don't remember a lot about him, but when we seen the name come across, you know, mom was right. It's like, this is someone we haven't done in a really long yeah. time. And for those of you that are new, we got a slogan. We got to give the people what they want. So y'all want some Harry Nilsson. And before y'all leave here, there's a couple things we ask you guys to do. All right, guys. So go ahead and like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on your post notification bell so we never miss out on hanging out together. Come join the RSR Familia. They're the best family on all of YouTube. And we're talking about you guys. Harry Nilsson, without you, let's check it out. Nilsson... No, I can't forget this evening Or your face as you were leaving But I guess that's just the way the story goes You always smile, but in your eyes Your sorrow shows Yes, it shows I can't forget tomorrow when I think of all my sorrow and I had you there but then I let you go and now it's only fair that I should let you know what you should know Absolutely beautiful voice. Like, there's parts in a song where he goes off, and we, I don't think we've ever said it about any other male singers. We say it a lot about females, like fairy tale. When he goes into that kind of stretch, uh, well, he, just, yeah. he just lets it go. Because he's got a bit of a, and I don't know the like correct a, term, uh, a shake. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that, that, that definitely like makes it feel like it soars a little more. But like in the other parts before he, you know, really started to let the notes go free, it was like such a, a haunting way in which he was singing. And obviously he's doing such a good job like with the, the haunting way and he's singing, portraying what the song's about. I mean, he's talking about this woman that basically now that she's not with him, now that he's let her go, like he's really depressed. He's right. sad. He misses her. And so the haunting way that he says it right there, you feel it. But then when he soars the notes and, you know, even the little shake in it, like you can almost feel the pain there, too. So it's cool. So I'm glad you said haunting because I, I was going to bring it up. It's like right when he starts getting to those spots, um, the drums and the violin right there, the, yeah. the, those little bitty pieces kind of give it that kind of eerie, haunting yeah, and, feel. I guess I could say the drums and violin give it the dramatic feel right yeah. when he's hitting those and parts. And then if you add in how sometimes he'll ever so lightly just hauntingly sing, like that adds on to it too. Nilsson Schmilson. I am liking it, Mr. Harry. Let's get back. I can't forget this evening or your face as you were leaving. But I guess that's just the way the story goes You always smile, but in your eyes your sorrow shows Yes, it shows
one of my favorite parts in that song, and I don't know why it just it attracted my ears to it. The little subtle parts, the uh, huh, 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 huh. Oh uh, my gosh. Violin. <laughs> yeah, I love... And it was in the background, so it was so cool. I love how anytime we get violin or anything like orchestra type, like suddenly Jay turns into I'm the telling director. You, like, like, I'm, I'm telling you, you go something look about back that and he, violin. It turns and he's just like, like he's viol- got that stick and he's directing <laughs> away. The violin has become one of my absolute favorite instruments. And the way that it's implemented, we've heard it in classical. We've heard it even in some... In fiddle. The fiddle. Oh, you, I was just about to say that. In some country, we've heard it implemented in some rock. It's just such a cool instrument right along with, you know, being a bass being one of my favorites as well. And I think it added so much to this song. You said, uh, I think you said something along dreamy. Uh, yeah, You know, that type like of vibe. The, the way that he... Uh, yeah, and so I love how they paired, you know, the instruments that sounded so dreamy, but also they had a bit of the haunting effect that he had in his voice and you really felt the pain that second time he hit the chorus he just belted out with that note like it was absolutely beautiful and it just carried so much with it and he held it for so long i think that is such a memorable performance but that alone that part the second part of the chorus i think Wow. Like, what... And the I second time the chorus like, What What is that that one at Disney where... Mig- Phil of Magic? Is that Phil what it is? Phil Magic. Phil of Magic. Like, that's what Harry Nielsen... It reminded me he was in the center of that. And it had yeah, all, I mean, you know it's I'm just because it about? had those roaring moments. Yes, I guess. Yeah. that is exactly the type of vibe that it gave me. But, mm-hmm. guys, thank y'all so, so much for that. It's been way too long, and we will definitely... Definitely be getting back to him, you know, before seven, eight months again, yeah. no doubt, because I forgot how great of a voice he really had. I think this one definitely um, left a mark. You put, know, it, left, put, put it, put it on the map. on your brain so you'll never forget. But as we always send y'all out of here, we love you, we thank you, we appreciate you, and remember every single day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed no matter the circumstances. And for you new family members that hit the subscribe button, we welcome y'all to the RSR family, but y'all will go every day just like we do. Tell them that goal. It makes somebody smile, y'all. We love you guys. Until next time, we'll see y'all later.